Michelle. You took me to school, you, you did my hair, you taught me how to ride a bike. I loved you. I was an undercover police officer. Your dad was the target. You could have left it on the latch, or it might have been the wind. I know, a break-in when I see one. This isn't a trip down memory lane, Dad. This is serious. Give up, you mean? Not a chance. She deserves to suffer for what she did to us. So you came up with this from day one? He asked me to keep tabs on you, but that wasn't why I stayed. I want you out. <laughs> no, but I need you. I love you. I've got a right to know. So I want him here now, so I can ask you both together. So what are we supposed to do now? Give us support to make inroads with her son. Separately. And Olivia Bromley, who plays Emma Deals. Dawn is here now. What a turbulent time Dawn has had since she started. Yes. And it's sort of, it's almost difficult to succinctly condense what her life has been, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> For anyone that hasn't been watching. But well, I'll slightly attempt it. Okay. Um, you have a child in foster care. Yeah. Uh, your dad was a drug smuggler. Mm -hmm. You had your own addiction problems. Your yeah. stepmother turned out to be an undercover policewoman who's now yes. the vicar. Um, very good. Uh, is there anything else? No, that's, that's, pretty, that's pretty, pretty much pretty it, isn't it? Yeah, quite a roller coaster. <laughs> it is a roller coaster, yeah. Um, but what a role to take on from your perspective, Olivia. It's yeah. just fabulous. And you never kind of know what way it's going to turn. I know. And she's such a complicated character and she's not always likeable. She's very flawed, um, but that's so lovely to play. Um, and she's very vulnerable as well. So we've had, I've had a real gift with the writers making this backstory for her, so it's brilliant. And nominated as Best Newcomer, coming yeah. up now in September at the TV Choice Awards. So it's yeah. been a really wonderful time for you, considering this is the first television mm. job. Yeah, I'm so So your first thrilled. day on Emmerdale set is the first time ever on a yeah. TV set. Yeah, which was so daunting, I have to say, because obviously it's such a fast turnaround with filming. Um, it's very technical. You've got this huge crew and everything. So it, it was a bit of a baptism of fire, to be honest. But um, I love it there, and it's, it's a very welcoming atmosphere. And stuff. What was it like to, to sort of arrive on at Emmerdale for the first time, never having done it before? I mean, that must have been yeah, God, sort well, of daunting, I guess. <laughs> I remember, I think on my first day, all I had to do was slam a door, walk in and slam a door, and I thought... I can't do that. I cannot do that. <laughs> I'm so nervous, but um, everyone's lovely. It's a very, it's a very warm atmosphere, and I was quite lucky. And um, I've been working with uh, Catherine Dalblyton and Dean Andrews, who are lovely, and they've done loads of um, other stuff before this. So I've been quite lucky to be able to kind of watch them and learn the ropes. Learn the ropes, of yeah. course, because music was something that you were always sort of into yeah. musical theatre, in fact, and that's yeah, kind yeah, of yeah. your background. And acting was something you were interested in, but it wasn't necessarily what you wanted no, to do. No, I, I didn't come to it until um, quite a bit later, actually. And so I went to uni and I studied music and I, I was working uh, for a production company and I wasn't really sure what I was going to do. And then I ended up getting a bursary to the Oxford School of Drama and went and made that mad decision. Fantastic. Here I am. <laughs> and your granny, I believe, is your biggest yeah, fan. I she know. must feel terribly proud of you. It's funny, yeah, she knows so much about Emmerdale now, more than me, probably. <laughs> um, yeah, it's lovely, so she watches it, which is really nice. Because and you couldn't even watch your, your debut night, could oh, you, no. just from that oh, sort God. of nervousness? It's so and... awful watching yourself, I have to say, it, it is the worst. <laughs> and um, so the first time that we aired, especially because I was very beaten up at the time, the character was having a really tough time, tears streaming and everything, and I just thought, I can't do it, I had to stand outside the room. <laughs> But my family watched it. Of quite course nice. they do. And they've <laughs> continued to do so, obviously. Yeah, obviously. <laughs> How have the um, audience reacted to your character and to you now? Because we sit watching at home feeling like it's all very real. And when we see you, you want to talk about what the storyline is. You must get a yeah. lot of that now. It, it's nice. Um, yeah, people do come up and... I think people have reacted well. It's, it's been really lovely that people have kind of connected with this woman because she's, she's not always likeable. She makes terrible decisions, but... Um, people seem to know that her heart's in the, in the right place. So. Yeah, yeah. Will Dawn have a happy ending at all here? Will she have oh. a bit of happiness in her life? I know she's trying to play Cupid a little bit at the minute, yeah. isn't she? I hope so. I really hope so. So at the moment, this is the first time in the storyline that she sees maybe a glimmer of hope that there could be a family unit there for her, which is what she's been wanting for so long. And potentially there might be a little bit of romance for her. 
Oh, add a, you know, so a little bit, a little bit of joy. I, I mean, it's soap, so it might be short-lived, but no. <laughs> hopefully we'll have a nice. A but nice it is. It's a proper soap character, isn't it? Yeah. Because of that backstory and because of I the know. twists and turns, it, it makes it quite exciting. It's so before. dramatic, and uh, yeah, it's a bit of a gift to be able to play such kind of um, yeah, like highs and lows of a character with yeah. such a big, rich backstory. So. I'm really happy. Right. Well, maybe she'll have a bit of luck after all then, Olivia. <laughs> it's great <laughs> so, to see you. Thank, thank you, you. Thank very so much. much.